Poor man's in the back screening calls at 818-578-1067. We have the Pandoras here to help you out with your love problems. That and sounds good. I'm here to handle any medically related love problems. And, and of course, usual, we'll have your, your special segment at 1240. We sure will. We've got and a then, full house tonight, let me tell that's you. That's right. I'll tell you, we got, we got four Pandoras here for love advice. Am I right, girls? Huh? Yeah. Okay, why don't you all introduce yourselves here and tell us what you play in the band real quick. I'm Paula, the singer and guitar player. I'm Kim, the bass player. And I'm Karen, the drummer. And I'm Melanie, the keyboard player. <laughs> and, I, and I assume all of you girls have plenty of uh, knowledge about uh, love matters. Oh, yeah. Of course. We're very yeah. knowledgeable. Yeah, that's the best advice. <laughs> and Dr. Drew, of course, is here, as always, trying to intermingle and commingle with the guests. <laughs> is that what I'm doing? Are you uh, mingling with us? <laughs> <laughs> He's just a commingler of the 80s. Dr. Man. Drew, we might add, of course, is our one medical doctor, the real doctor here, and the rest of us are self proclaimed love doctors. That's right. And yeah. at 1240, we'll be handling those specifically medically related love problems. In the oh, meantime, yeah. what do we have? Well, should we sing tonight, Permit? Yeah, oh, we, yeah, the girls should sing. They you should definitely yeah. sing. Yeah. Girls, have you ever heard our love line jingle? Yeah. You yeah. have? Oh, Karen's heard it. What? Okay, here, give I've them a... Heard it. Okay, we'll give you a demonstration here. One and a two and a one, two, three, four. Love line. It's that... <laughs> It's, it's very nice. Yeah, it's that easy. Now all four of you can do it. A okay. one and a two and a one, two, three, four. Love lines. I'm glad we taped that. You said you got to take the S off the end there. Okay, <laughs> okay let's go That's first. That's like a plural. This first call. Well, first, we want to um, first let people know what the format here is. We're going to take two, two ladies at a time each segment there so we don't have <laughs> seven people answering one phone call. So who who's gonna sit in with us for this first segment here? Kim and Paula. Okay, yeah. Kim and Paula, you guys are gonna do this segment right now. All right, let's start out and go to um, hmm, boy, this is a tough one. <laughs> Line number four, we got Mike, 19 years old, from West LA. And you're on the air, Mike. Welcome to Love Line, Mike. What's your love problem? Yeah, well, it seems that I always, you, you know, turn off women by. I'm doing all sorts of gestures, like picking my nose, or... That's cool! Or let's say you're, like, scratching some itch that I have. I don't know, it seems that those things always come up at right at the point where I'm meeting somebody. Sounds like my kind of guy. Yeah, really, it's... You're down to earth. It's just human. It but shouldn't turn off people. Just I, find actually, I pick my nose and wipe it on my boyfriend too. <laughs> <laughs> I can tell we're gonna have a great show here tonight. <laughs> so, so this guy basically, as far as you girls say, think does not have a problem at all. No, right? just you know, it depends on the girl. You know, if you're going out with some wimpy little girl, then That's don't do prude. that. <laughs> yeah, some little prude, then don't wipe your nose or I mean, pick your nose or butt or whatever in front of her. <laughs> just do it in the privacy of your own bathroom, but. But if you um, if you go out with someone like us or someone like that, then go for it. <laughs> All right, Th that's the. Okay, I think that's the answer. Thank you, Mike, and you can Sorry go back to to, uh, you. <laughs> to uh, doing some good strumming and picking. 